glass rat poison do next to my biscuits? I'm putting this shit in here. I think we've got a rat infestation. Wankers nicked all my biscuits again. Maybe it was the rats. What, are you trying to tell me that a rat just crawled into my cupboard, opened up the biscuit tin, and ate all my fucking biscuits? And I was a like, fucking wanker, Nathan. That happened to me as well. Think someone's playing pranks? Last night? Uh, you know, this and that. <laughs> Fucking apple juice tastes disgusting. Try it. Oh, that's rank. Someone's been playing with that, mate. You want to take it back to the shop? It's not the shop's fault. Fucking Nathan. Circumstances, Sean. There appears to be no toilet paper. I was certain that a pack was acquired yesterday. Yeah, there should be loads. Uh, I'll go and have a look. Thank you, going sir. There you go, mate. They're all in Simon's room. I leave them outside the door, yeah? What ever would he require that amount of paper for? <laughs> Don't reckon it was for personal use, mate. I think you've been pranked. You would think, what a fascinating development. Can you believe the audacity of this man? He's just sent me a text message asking if I can make him a cup of tea. I am not his butler. <laughs> I'm surprised he's not worried about you uh, spitting in his tea or something. sister over to watch a uh, DVD with me. Ça t'est égal? Je ne suis plus la petite fille à moi. Of course I don't mind. It's always a pleasure to see you, dear sister. Is that my fucking bow tie? Who can say, mate? Who can say? I think I'm ready to go again. Seems someone decided to plant drugs in my jacket and then took off my boss. But you're joking. So look like I'm fucking joking.
Lucky they never called the fucking police. But have you got any idea who did it? I know exactly who did it. No, surely you don't think it was Nathan? Of course I do. You know what these posh boys are like. Cocaine forms part of a normal three-course meal for these high society wankers. Surely you wouldn't go that far. I mean, that's pretty low. I don't know. You didn't see his face when our sister was wiping my cum from my mouth. <laughs> True. So, uh, what are you going to do now then? You got a note? Someone did a number of my bicycle brakes. They completely failed on me. Are you sure they weren't just faulty, mate? Impossible. They were cut clean through. That fucking wanker Simon's playing a dangerous game with me. I mean, he hasn't had much luck himself, you know. He got the sack as well. Fucking splendid. He deserved that. I'm, uh, I'm sorry to hear you lost your job today, Simon. It was a bit of a fucking surprise. I see um, you managed to get yourself into a spot of bother as well. Yes, well, quite. It uh, would seem we've both been experiencing a run of bad luck lately. Yeah. Well, uh, maybe, maybe we could put all of this bad luck behind us and, and move on. Well, you know what? I drink to that. Go on then. Uh, how does a drop of the old Vin Rouge tickle your fancy? Now you're talking my language. Bottoms up old, shall they? Easy, easy. How about uh, some crisps to help line our stomach? Um, I can't argue with that. Salt and vinegar? Uh, uh, yes, yes. Again. Maybe it was the rat.
Fiddlesticks. Fucking apple juice tastes disgusting. <laughs>